Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu In this tutorial I will show you how to split a video file uh, a lengthy video file into various parts uh, making it 10 minutes each so if you got a 1 hour file 1 hour video file then you can split the length into 10 minutes each and it will save it into 6 different files and I will show you how to split a video file. For that, first we'll install this particular application. If you are on Ubuntu Linux or any other, you know, Linux distros, you can check. Uh, you can check this particular. Okay, you visit this website bunkers.org/video-tools/slash. I'll add this uh, URL as usual uh, on my description box, or you can just search MQB Merge over here on Google, and you'll get this link over here. So let's install it on Ubuntu. John Tijak Club. You just add these two lines to your sources dot list okay otherwise you can like uh, launch your soft software sources add these two lines and then you download this particular txt file to your desktop and add the authentication key after that you can sudo app get update and sudo app get install mk tool next okay i'll do i'll, I'll add those steps over there and um, on in my description box and then after you install it on your terminal window will go with the splitting with the files so here i've got an mp3 file avi file with xvid stream and a mp3 audio stream and I'll, I'll give you a complete tutorial about this on this application inshallah you know later on but right now it's just about splitting the file so we go to the global tag over here global tab and then uh, we click on enable splitting so right now you can check this like if you want to split the file with respect to this file size as in like you wanna you don't want to mm, exceed a particular size limit let's say 5 MB then you can do that over here but uh, depending upon the bitrate of the var uh, video like if it is a obviously it will be a variable bitrate then uh, this won't really come handy unless uh, if you're you know trying to uh, rare it and upload it somewhere where there is a file size limit otherwise let's uh, go with the tutorial so we choose this after this tutorial uh, after this du duration we click on the checkbox over here and we specify the time we want obviously I will add 600 seconds 600 zero s, s otherwise you can add like uh, 0 hours uh, 10 minutes 0 seconds you could add either of these like uh, what do you call this either of this syntaxes or keywords or uh, time codes yeah I'll, I'll, I'll prefer 600 seconds I prefer 600 seconds so um, we have got 600 seconds which means 10 minutes of course so we'll split this file into six different parts now no no I mean we'll split this file into 10 minutes each this video over to 10 minutes each here I've got an MQ file I'll save it to desktop start mixing and check it out so mixing in progress this particular file uh, is uh, mpg4 part 2 video output module I mean mpg4 mpeg4 part 2 video so here you see this is the first file and the Q entries index are being written. Yes, this is the first file, second, third, fourth, fifth. So this meant that video, this particular video was uh, approximately 55 minutes. Okay, 47 minutes. So it's splitting this particular file into five different parts. Here we've got one, two, three, four, five. Did it transcode? Did it convert? I mean, did it convert the whole file into different uh, format? No. It, it is just like doing copy paste. It's that it's that fast. That is why I wanted to share because a lot of people split their files to upload to YouTube, and I don't know what application they use. And I have been using this. Uh, I've been using this application for a long time now so I thought I'll just share check the length over here it's 10 minutes and now you upload it to YouTube that's it that's with the tutorial it's split into five different parts and everything is working you, you can check the thumbnail over here uh, everything went fine okay you can check the status over here if there is like if it returns a different code that means just it might be like you might find some warnings over here or errors 
with regard to this video there is no error or warning and I've done it successfully inshallah I'll just like make more tutorial on this particular application as in attaching multiple audio files switching your audio files like you have this particular video file over here but you don't want that audio which is from this video but you want to add an external audio you can do that so this is a really handy application really useful and I'll tell you how to sw uh, stretch your audio as in uh, fast forward your audio or slow down the audio instead of using those heavy applications obviously those are like professional uh, tools that you guys you know mostly use but this is just a simple tool which will just change some let's say like syntaxes or codes in the video file that is the mkv file and it will give you amazing capabilities uh, yeah right so that's it assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi